Alright, so here's a look of the new Sync 4 system that I installed on my 2017 Ford Fusion. The only problem I'm having, I had to make some modification to the wiring of it. But, um, I tried to plug it in directly and it short out the whole network system. So as soon as I plug it in, I could not turn my car on or anything like that no commands I could not get to start no lights no instrument cluster or anything like that so I compared a wiring diagram from a 21 f-150 to a 2017 fusion and what I noticed was the um, f-150 don't have the high-speed one network and the MS network so I disconnected the high speed one and I finally got it to boot up. But the problem I'm running into is the let's see if that works. Yeah, so some of these functions don't work, of course. But the problem I'm running into is the I can't find APIM on uh Forescan or UCDS. So I cannot program this module to the vehicle because I cannot find it. But here's just a little looks of it. And I've noticed a couple other things that don't work. So like that, nothing works there. I'm not surprised. Daytime lights, nothing. High beams, nothing. The locks. I haven't tested any of these out, so I don't even know if they work or not. Nothing works there. But I was able to get the SYNC 3 system, or the SYNC 4 system, to work on the SYNC 3 screen. Which I was uh, very surprised about. Another thing too I noticed is when I change things, so my speedometer, I would have it on the, where it reads the how fast I'm going. And I'll have it to kilometers, but every time I turn the car off and restart, it would default back to there and the kilometers would disappear and I'd have to re-enable it every single time. Another thing too I noticed, my voice command, I lost that. So when I push the voice command, nothing happens. But I have mute, I got radio stations. Another thing too I noticed is when I turn on the car, my phone's automatically connected to Bluetooth but when I shut the car off and restart it, it always goes back to the FM station. But like the controls, if I hit that, you can see that it changes it. The volume, it works, but it won't display. So I'm changing the volume. Okay, there it goes. But it would not, it don't display it. So I'm thinking this is a programming issue. But the problem I'm running into though, I can't get it to show up on Forescan or UCDS to make changes that I need to. General. I know it's like these, the measurements, I can't change them at all either. Tire pressure. Nothing. I can disable the touch beep. Let's click on about sync. Parking mode on. Then another thing too I noticed is um, the compass on here, it does not change. So I think since the 21 F-150 is different, 
uh, it uses the telematic control module for whichever way you're going. I noticed the automatic system updates don't do nothing. And schedule updates, but that ain't gonna work since uh, I don't have it wirelessly. Updates detail. Systems up to date. I'm gonna try this one. 911 assist. Uh, connectivity. Another thing too, I don't know if it's because uh, my hotspot's not, com or my TCU's not compatible and not wired up for it, so it just goes back to there. Bluetooth. I can, oh, I can change the name of it too. That's cool. So I can have Nick's car or whatever Ford Fusion, whatever I want to change my Bluetooth name to. Wireless app projection. I have that enabled and I connect to it. But I don't know how to figure out what this actually does. Manage Wi-Fi networks, that'd be where if you want to connect to your house Wi-Fi. Mobile apps, I believe that'd be... So I guess if you have USB, all apps, I don't know what this will do, okay, nothing apparently. display com screen tap on that and that just sends you right back to default so I'm heading west it shows I'm heading north so I know that's not right I took it on a little run and it doesn't change at all uh, let's see go back to display you can change your mode to nighttime. Kind of notice it is a little bit buggy, so it doesn't respond too well. Uh, valet mode, not for sure what that does. Nope. Vehicle hotspot. It brings me to this page here. I go to settings and it'll just kick me right back out. I guess because my TCU is not compatible or I don't have my TCU wired up to the Ford F 150 spec. But I believe I've gone through all of it. If you guys was curious on what it looks like, like I said, this one here, it's got all this stuff here. But that's the one thing I noticed was. Uh, this would go back to default, everything would be off and on the main page. Obviously since this Ford F-150 didn't have uh, heated seats or anything like this, I ain't gonna show the indicator even though it's turned on. The volumes don't work. It works, but it doesn't display. And the voice command, nothing happens when you push it. And I can't find the APIM module on the network. I even tried using an Altel scanner and it doesn't show either. So I got some more tinkering around to try to figure out how to get to show in the network. I don't know if it's just because it's so new, Forescan has not enabled it where it will search for the APIM or what. So 